So I just rolled our 2280 BH ESP out of the storage shed. I opened it up, checking it out, no mice. It looks great. But this is the last time we'll ever see this camper because we traded it. I'm so excited about the next chapter that I haven't given it much thought, you know, about all the things we've been through in this camper, all the places we've seen, and all the moments in time with our kids growing up. I mean, they were little. We got this right before COVID, right before prices skyrocketed, got a great deal on it. Didn't know it at the time, but we did. I've had to do a ton of work to fix the building issues with this camper. That wasn't fun. But once I fixed them, oh, it's been great. It's been dry, no more dripping water on my kid's head. <laughs> that was funny. But we've been all over, mostly New England. And we've enjoyed it. But the kids got big. The family just getting bigger. And uh, we bought a hard side. This will be the last time I'm inside of this thing. I'm going to close it up, and that'll be it. The thing I'm going to miss the most, though, is being part of pop-up culture. It's different, and it's cool. I'm definitely going to miss you guys. I'll be lingering around, but it's not the same, right? All right, I just did the demo day with Bruce. I went through everything. And this is our new camper. It is a 264 BH. Real simple, clean layout. No slide out. I was looking for weight. This camper has a master suite separated by a curtain. It has sink, oven, microwave, dining, TV, storage, bunk beds. And these are huge because our kids are getting huge. Sink separate from the bathroom. Huh? I mean, look at that. And a freezer and a fridge. Look, an AC. We used a portable AC, but this is a built in AC with a thermostat and ceiling vents. And the only reason this is possible, because we bought a new truck. So this thing's gonna stay here and they're gonna park it for us. And then when the snow melts finally in our yard, maybe in a couple of months, we're gonna come get it. Goodbye, Sarge. So this is pickup day, I just got here. This is a lot, a storage lot for campers. We got a whole bunch of them here. Anyways, this is it. So when I bought it, it had brand new 30 gallon propane tanks. This is what ended up on it. I got an email after I left that said, how'd you like to buy upgrade 30 gallon tanks? I said it already had them on it. No, it didn't. <laughs> so I'm gonna leave those propane tanks here. I don't want those things. They can have them. They can put them on the pop-up if they want. Look at this. Not bad for a first time setup, right? Working in the dirt lot. That's it, folks. 264BH.